Okay, this is the name Cody in Descript. First, let's look at the simplest possible combination, and that is a simple C O D Y, Cody. Now, you can make some circles bigger, some circles smaller, so you could go C O D Y. I don't know, it depends on what you want to draw in it, especially if you start doing text art or actually drawing graphics into this and you're maybe using them as planets and moons, the ratios or whatever you want them to be, it doesn't matter at all, as long as they're circles. So, what can we do that's more fun? Well, first of all, starting off this word, we're looking at a C. Beautiful, because we got two possibilities. C's develop side chains, we have two options, and you can use both. You can go C, O, D, Y. How do you know to read that first? Well, we follow the standard uh, Descript reading principles. Top to bottom, left to right. So we know that's going to come before the bottom part. Anyways, now, so what else can we do? OD. How does OD connect? Well, you could connect OD like this, but you don't need this. Why don't you need that? Well, there's two letters. We'll quickly review it. Here's D, and here is H. If you connect D to O, you get this. If you connect O to H, you get this. So why... It, the H always requires this, but the D does not. Some people ask me why, and I said, well, I just chose the most frequent combination. OD is used a heck of a lot more than OH, therefore OD gets priority. And if it's ambiguous, it's defined as OD. You can change those rules if you like, but you'll find you'll be drawing more strokes if you reverse that rule. And then, what else can we do here? Well, when we get to the D, we could consider putting the Y onto one of the edges or something. But there's nothing too crazy there. So let's see what we can do here. We can go C, O, D, Y. Make that nice and big for fun. That way works. Let's try to make it all kind of evenly sized, though. And let's try to fit it into a box. So, C, O. I could try putting the D through there like that. You can also rotate things 90 degrees. The beautiful thing about Descript is it doesn't matter if you rotate them 90 degrees. This system is designed so it can be. For example, um, the D is also a D. An E is also an E. Everything can be done like this. Unlike English, where B, P, Q, D, all of these letters, when you start flipping them and rotating them, you have no idea what you what you wrote anymore when you go back to read it. So let's try to fit this into the space. Using that version, we can go C, O, D, Y. That's not a very good square, actually, I just realized. Let's make it a little more squared off. So there's one way to write Cody. This way is probably more fun. Cody. And as you can see, you've got tons of options. I would say go with something. I, I actually prefer the OD combination. So I would say you'd want to leave yourself the OD open and keep it vertical. So I'd say maybe something like this. Put the ODY into the O. Kind of like it. Cody.